I want to make a beat make a video today. I'd like to do it because I haven't done it yet and I want to do it. But before I do that, I need to figure out how to transfer files between my Digitech and the computer. Like, these creaky floors are going to be the death of this studio. Pretty cool. I just uh, successfully recorded some sounds from the Digitech 2 into the computer. So, to me, that means I'm ready. So I might do a little filming with my phone. I need to get like a, I need to get one of those stands. That'll film from the top and then I can just hopefully hook my phone into it. First beat making video, official. It's official, folks. It's official, folks. Don't have my phone. Don't have my phone. Okay, it's probably, it's probably in the bathroom. Okay, it was definitely in the bathroom just for the folks out there to see what we're working with. So, here we are, first person. This cord's way too long, always, so it's gonna go around my neck until it chokes me to death. I am going to open up a new project on this. I'm gonna go into projects. I'm gonna load this one. Yes, loading. I called this track history, and it technically is history because I accidentally deleted it when I was trying to upload it to my computer. Good news is I got some of it uploaded. Let's go to projects, manage, and I'm gonna start a new one. Initiate new. I'm gonna name it Dig1. Piano, sure. Yes, pads. Holding on your rope, got me 10 feet off the ground. Phrases. Yes. Man, do you see my back? It was just getting so, man, my shirt is tucked in. Let's see if I change the tempo. <laughs> Going up to 165 BPM right now. Turn it on the metronome just so I can hear. Got that looping. It's a good start. So 80.5 BPM right now. Yeah, I'm the mother flipping. Increased the decay a little bit. I want to add a page. Let's go to source. I want to tune it up a little. Okay, I'm going to do function trig. I'm going to do the change the swing, see if that helps. Okay, I'm going to add a little reverb to it. There we go. What? Record? I just had such a big freaking brain fart. That's crazy. Oh, right. I need to add a page. That's what I need to do. One, two, three, four. All right, so I did it, uh, but I did it on the wrong pages. So technically, it really doesn't matter that much because once I get it into Ableton, uh, I can move it around. So let's leave it at that for now. So it's at negative 9.87 on my Ableton. So that means I'm okay, because I'm shooting for negative three to negative six. Yeah, wrong place. Oops. I wanna, I wanna live my life. Added a couple more of those hits. Put a little high pass on it. Overdrive. 40 of it. Like it so far. Negative 7.8. All right, here's the thing. So, now that all the sounds are over, I'm gonna get this out of the way because it's kind of in my way. Goodbye. Here we go. I don't 
don't want any highs really. Let's try putting like a Arteria Fragments. Let's see if that sounds like anything. Oh yeah. Mm, let's do... Let's do a normal delay from Ableton. Let's put this here so it's a little different. Low cut. All right, so let's smash those, hit H. Uh, I'm gonna get rid of these because these are just template files. Sounds kind of cool. Let's try that. That's not bad. I just want this one to be a little higher. Yeah, I don't mind that sound there, but I don't think I like it. Let's take this one off. I want to put some reverb on those keys just a little. Let's do a vintage verb. We're in it, baby. I don't need all the low in here. Yeah, much better. Okay, I'll, I'll go with that. Take, I'm just gonna duplicate the bass sound. And I think I'm gonna add like a distortion or something. I like to use, I think, Saturn 2. I think it's like a saturation. I'm guessing that's why it's called Saturn. Yeah, I think I might just like that. Let's do that for now. Do another duplicate. And let's take you, put you here, and delete you. even more saturation. That's not bad, that's not bad. I feel like that's gonna definitely come back in later. I want like a voice here. Like a vocal. I'm hearing a female voice. Let's, I just want to see what happens. And let's throw it in here. Let's try a little altered voice. See if we can just like barge with it, farge with it. If we can Marge Simpson with it a little bit more. No, I hate that. Okay. All right, we're gonna put a utility on my drum break because it's getting a little quiet now in the mix. I'm gonna deactivate that. I like to deactivate clips now just so I know that something was there. And then um, I can always put it back. All right, I wanna put some static. Put some static on it. Let's try that.
Needs to be some reverb on here. Nice. Let's see if that works. I want to fade these out, let's highlight and stretch them all so I can see them all. Let's try this first. Let's try right here. Let's do a riser. I'm done for that one. And let's take you and I'm gonna go boop. And high cut. Just gonna copy and paste. I'm just gonna put some more reverb because it's a freaking riser, dude. All right, I'm gonna lower these because they're like clashing with the sounds, I think. So if I lower them, let's try moving it over. I like that. Let's do a little less though. Alright, I'm I'm into this so far. Let's listen. 